All right, stop that. Hello, everyone, and welcome to the showdown of the week 2018. I am the Outside Xbox announcer, a person you have not heard before, and I want you to put your hands together to welcome your host for the evening, the charming, wonderful Andy Farrant! Hello! Oh, man. Man, that announcer, what a... What a flatterer, he's always saying nice things about me, that's great. Hello everyone, welcome to the showdown of the week. It is the annual custom that has now become a yearly tradition in which we pit the members of Outside Xbox against the members of Outside Extra to determine who is the greatest YouTube channel in the universe, at least until next year. So, I know what you're thinking. Outside, outside Xbox, Andy, you're on Outside Xbox. Isn't that one of the channels competing today? How on earth are you going to be impartial? Well, two things. First of all, I don't care for your tone. <laughs> Secondly, I take the title of Showdown Master extremely seriously. I would do nothing to bring the glorious title of Supreme Showdown Commander, I added the Supreme, Showdown Commander into disrepute. Also, Jane was in charge last year and we lost. So, although I am, I'm over it, so that is fine. So, without further ado, I'm going to bring out the teams. We're going to start with the team who unfortunately lost last year. I say unfortunately, I'm impartial. <laughs> it's fine. Uh, it's, we're gonna bring out Jane Douglas and my channel, Outside Xbox. It is team one, everybody. Please welcome to the stage. <laughs> Welcome to the showdown. How are you feeling? Pretty good. Nervous right. excitement, I think. Yeah, and how do you rate your chances in, uh, in the showdown? We are going year? to crush okay. their spirits. And their bodies. And, and their bodies. Yeah, and their well. bodies okay. as well. Okay, so you, you, you're feeling good? Feeling you know, pretty bumped, yeah. yeah. Okay. I know yeah. the crowd are behind us, right? Ish. Slight delay? Yeah. So slight, <laughs> slight delay. Okay. No, it's, cool. <laughs> it's cool. Like I said, I'm impartial. Uh, okay, well, that's fine. We're going to bring out. Uh, some know them Who have as you got? small and tall. Oh. Some know them as Luke and Ellen. We know them as Outside Extra. It's Team 2, everybody! Outside Extra! <laughs> well, here they are, last year's champions. How do you feel, guys? Pretty good. <laughs> I'm feeling good, Andy. Smug <laughs> is the word, I think. Good. You're looking Smug. <laughs> Confident. And uh, how have you spent your last year as champions? Basking. Largely <laughs> basking. A lot of uh, endorsement work. Um, yeah. Public traveling, appearances. Traveling the world. Ambassadors for the yeah. showdown. Exactly. Yeah, sure. You know, we, we take this around the world and we show people and it gives them hope. <laughs> <laughs> it, you know, just a little bit of our success can be inspiration. So, yeah, I mean, I'm inspired right now looking at you. It's in spite of vomit. Hugely inspirational. So, wow. Oh, come on, it's all fun. Wow. <laughs> Good thing I'm impartial. So, <laughs> how do you guys uh, rate your chances this year of retaining your crown? There it is. Look at it. Look at it. Hold it up. Let That's the not a crown, see. Andy. That's a cup. I it's a metaphorical it so crown. <laughs> it's a metaphorical crown. Metaphorical. How do, you, how do you feel your chances are this year? Well, we're actually up against an excellent team. Yes. These guys. Uh, a very strong team. Very strong very team. Strong team. What's this? <laughs> is someone going to die at doing? the end of this? What are you do oh, is this a... Oh, oh so humble. It's not yeah. a battle royale, is I'm it? <laughs> Everyone's bloody doing yeah. a battle royale. I think we're going to... I think we're going to try our best, don't we, Evan? And smaller. can you ask anyone to do more than their best? Yeah. No. I, I don't think you can. No. So, okay, now to remind you what we're playing for, the winner of the showdown of the week, 2018, will get bragging rights for the year, but also this magnificent trophy. It is extremely handsome, valuable, and covetable, <laughs> as it was expensive and hard to make. Look at it. <laughs> it's good. So, you want this, guys? You want this trophy? Oh, yeah. So you, want this trophy? you want this trophy this yeah. year? Then earn it! <laughs> Earn it. I feel like at this point we should give the trophy to Andy. Yes. So we officially... the trophy, please. And I will... He's impartial! He's impartial! And now... <laughs> no! No! What did we do? I will be back Victory shortly. for outside <laughs> Xbox! No, all right. I will place the trophy here. Okay. In full view of the audience. So we no one's stealing it except me. Although I am impartial. He's so impartial. Okay, as we established last year, the showdown of the week 
keys into the key pillars of Outside Xbox and Outside Extra. Those pillars being violence, friendship, and charades. Oh, man. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Although this year, the charades round is being replaced with the music round. Oh. Because, Ooh. you know, everyone loves music. OK, so we're starting with the violence round, which is going to be represented <laughs> by the video game Nidhogg 2. Anyone know Nidhogg 2? Anyone see it? Yeah. yeah. OK, yeah. it is an extremely violent video game. So mm. that will be uh, a good time for us. But the, uh, the aim of Nidhogg 2 is, uh, Mike, do you want to explain this? Because you've played more than uh, that. It's to be eaten by a giant worm, as I understand it. All right, well, that was easy. It was, it's to be eaten by a giant worm. <laughs> uh, it's a sword fighting game, right? Like yeah. fencing, sword fighting, bow and arrows, little exactly, daggers. Exactly, exactly. Uh, and you have to get to the final screen and yep. then be consumed by the victory worm, yep. Nidhogg. Exactly. So the way this is going to work, Nidhogg 2 is a two-player game. So each team, they're going to have a five-minute round against each other. So Mike will play Jane, Luke will play Ellen, and then, after that, they're going to nominate their champion to play in the final to see who will get the point in round one. Violet. Mm. All right, so everyone, uh, if you want to come over here. Hang on. It's limbering. OK. OK, <laughs> oh, you're, 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 you're right. You can warm up. <laughs> so you guys are competing favorites. against each other. Yeah. Uh, and we're going to determine uh, who is the best uh, at Nidhogg 2. Uh, you guys are going to determine who's the best at Nidhogg 2. And then the best two players will face off in the final. It's going to be very exciting. Mm. OK. All right. All right, Jane, when you fancy fighting, uh, I want to go to the beach. To the beach? To the beach. Is that a beach? No. That's, that's a beach. 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 That's good. Mike is doing some very ineffectual savvy, man. Jane is on the test. Oh, oh, no. oh, no. oh, no. oh, oh, no! You are my friend! Man, OK. No! Yes, no! Oh, oh. I'm just training oh. you up, Jane. Except you're not training me up for that. Well, Jane isn't even focusing on the running, he's just killing. Just straight in OK. Oh, oh, oh. Fantasy this footwork. Is... OK, this is actually pretty Pumice. equal. I don't know. Ah! That was a See ya! That's Wait, impressive. Uh, okay. Here we go. Get out of the way. Oh, yes. oh, no, it's oh wait, no, you've still got the advantage. Run the, run the other way. Oh. Okay. Yes. I like the tactic of throwing the bow. <laughs> <laughs> Why waste time with the arrow? Oh. I've got that. Damn. Okay. okay. Oh, 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 no. Oh, oh. I'll have that. Oh, <laughs> oh God. Yes. Yeah. He's trying to get up. Oh. Wow. <laughs> Why do you got range on that? Oh. 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 Final oh, no, my head! Oh, oh no, no, my head! head. There's nothing left of the head! Oh, no! <laughs> no. <laughs> Alright, oh, oh, no. oh. Xbox, we want to pass the controllers over yes. Luke and Alan. OK. Right. Should we keep the same colors? I'm go Can we be I'm different colors? If you like, you can be whatever color you want. I want to be blue. You want to be blue, I'll be orange. Yes. 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 Yes
orange, yeah. Okay. Nice. We can announce blue. your colours so we know who's... I am blue. I am orange. Yes. <laughs> sure. Let's say Luke, that. Luke, you forgot to say dabba dee dabba die. Oh, no. <laughs> Is it too late? Yeah. No. You can <laughs> go on, do it. Go on, do it. Dabba dee dabba die. There we go. <laughs> okay. Here we okay. go. No, a torso. And how do you feel it after watching that... Uh, Hit X to mix and make yourself look weird. Okay. Yeah. Hey. Can... Oh, there we go. Hey, That's cool. Hello. Press X. Oh, nice. Oh, hey. oh I like it. Ooh. One, oh, yeah. three, straight away. I'm hey. keeping that. Oh my God, it's, <laughs> like, <laughs> it's like Ned Flanders. That's what's untrack. left of Luigi now. <laughs> <laughs> now that he's officially dead. Okay, the only thing I explicitly said was don't mention Luigi being dead. <laughs> <laughs> it's too soon. Too soon. Too soon. Too soon. <laughs> All right, come on then. Ready, right. let's go. I'm going to try pick a different uh, arena. Yeah. You got a good feeling about that fun tree? That, yeah, <laughs> it's, it's nice. It's very this one? <laughs> For sure. Yeah. The swamp? Stop yeah. Talking. All right, let's go to Swamp right. Town. Here we yeah. go. All right, guys. Okay. Oh, my God, that's horrible. Have a nice, clean... He's got a mushroom from nowhere. Yeah, I want to see a nice, uh, clean no, duel get, here. Get so, oh. 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 oh! Oh! Are you ready? First blood. First blood. Luke is not messing up. Oh! 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 Oh, he's just, he's Luke's on a tear. All right, Ellen, you need to defend. Oh, no, 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 Ganglion. Ganglion, yeah. Alright, all right. All right, to stand off. Oh! Yeah, all right, go, 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 go! Go, go, go! Jump! Jump! Oh! oh. All right. Peeved. Yes! Yes! yes. 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 My bridge. Right. Okay, Come this on. is good. Right hey, you'd like that, wouldn't you? How oh. about daggers thrown by me? You choose your destruction. So many unpleasant intestines. Ah. Ellen! Go, Ellen, go. Right. Ellen You've go. got a minute Ellen and eight go. seconds Ellen left go. to reclaim the lead. Yes! Yes! yes. yes. Good. Punch kick. But you have no one in the mind. Put it's all in your mind. Oh, oh wow! Oh wow! Oh, Cartwheel dress. Oh. When he said it's all in the mind, <laughs> stab her in the brain. Yeah. It's actually in the mind. Okay. Okay. okay ready? Ellen's getting you some ground here. Oh! Oh, she's oh, off. No. She's off. Don't jump! Don't jump! Don't jump! <laughs> <laughs> oh my! Oh, oh boy. All right, here we go. It's going that was, so well. Yeah, that was really something. Right. You have 35 seconds oh. left. I've got really something to see. How do we decide oh. who wins oh. if the. I think it's whoever's got the most yeah. ground. Yeah, right. ah. yeah, got most distance. Yeah, right. who's got the most ground. But of course, each team is able to nominate oh. the player that they want to play. It doesn't have to be whoever won. Okay. So, yeah. Why the bomb? Why the bomb? Go, 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 go. Yes, go. Yes, yes. Run, run. Oh, wow. Run, run, run. Oh, it's Hunter's Luke. 15 seconds to go. Oh, Who can gain ground? Stab! Jump! Stab again! Throw the Oh! Seven! Six! Five! Oh! Mutual destruction! Destruction! There we go! Alright! Oh, it's a duel! It's a final showdown! Alright, three, two, one, let's go! Oh! Wow! Wow, that is a lot of stuff coming out there! Alright! Boy, okay. Is it time for the final? It's time yeah, for it the is. final. Yeah, it is. So, which, who from which team will be represented in the final? I would final? Like, um, go, go you, meritocracy, you, I think. You, you won oh, fair right. and square. I would do well if we so only had bows. <laughs> <laughs> That's is not allowed. Is there an only bow moment? <laughs> <laughs> Probably, <laughs> but we're not playing it. <laughs> oh, man. OK, fine. Uh, uh, pass me a controller. Yeah. for that side anyway. I mean, uh, OK, so uh, it's going to be... It's going to be Mike for our Sandy. It's going to be Mike for our side Xbox. Yeah. And so I, said, be... so I said 15 minutes just in case yeah. we are. Alan? Is Alan going for? I think it's me. Okay, yeah. if you want to set the team right. colours. We are going to be green. Green versus yeah. purple. That's a really awful shade, but yeah. good. Mix it up again. Beautiful. Right. Oh, yes. Can I mix? Uh, there yeah. we go. Ooh. Nice. Yeah, nice like one, Hegan. Yeah, the oh, yeah no. there it is. Oh, get these going. Oh, I got like, like, like a, a, a like sort of gelée. Yeah, cut off gelée. Yeah, yeah. Cut-off gelée like is, uh, is a nice addition. Perfect. Looking good, guys. All right, so we so look, it shows you the weapon order. So you can see how yeah. you have to wait until the fourth weapon to get the boat. Oh. And then win. Right. Right. And then you'll win. Yeah. OK, so right. we're ready. We're ready for the the final. The final. contact with the With a 15-minute time limit. Who? We'll emerge victorious and get one point. Can't lose uh, any of <laughs> Where did you go? All right, for real this time. Can we go for the 
Let's go for dinosaurs. 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 Volcanoes. Dinosaurs. dinosaurs. Oh my god. Oh wow. And a okay. oh, right. volcano. Okay, no. All right. All right. I always knew it would end here. The tension ah. is high. Oh. All right. Oh, no. oh. Okay, you guys ready? Oh. Yes! Yes, right. 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 Okay, okay. Oh, that's good. Oh, it's a You've got a hand on you. Go, 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 go. Yes, good. All right, watch out for him. Right, Ellen, you need to block him at every turn. Yes, yes, you can't do that. That's good. Very nice. Okay. Now, ah. Remember, cheer for whoever you want to win, guys. If you want to hear some, hear some noise, we need. Well, well, well. Yes! I do the face! I insist you concentrate. How's that, Mike? Oh! Wow. I see why you like it, Alan. And then he's disrespecting me. Oh, 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 yes! Oh, no. Arrow in okay. the face. Oh. In the oh, face. oh! Man, yes. you're a demon with that bow. Yes, Ellen. Oh, yes! Oh, yes. Oh, yes! Unstoppable with yes. a bow. Yes! So, yeah. oh, yes! Oh, no. I'm having yeah, that, yeah. just in case. Oh, no! Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Why? What happens oh, now? Gosh. They they oh, oh, yeah, there we go. Advantage that usually does happen. There we go. Yes! I'll tell you what, that was cool. Oh, man. All right, yeah. you, you do well on this. Oh, nice. Look at that. very nice. You do well in this volcano territory. <laughs> yeah, oh, nice. Oh, yes. 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 No, no he's not. Oh. Go, 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 go. Got complacent. Oh. 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 Speculative oh. arrow. Speculative <laughs> arrow. <laughs> the, yeah. The, That's like right. green arrows, like, less <laughs> less <laughs> oh, no. Okay, okay here we go. Yeah. All right, the final screen. Yes, very good. Good. Race to the right, to the right. Go back up, you've got to go to the right. <laughs> I don't worry about the bow. Forget the bow! There's no time! Oh! Yes! No! Oh! Yes. Oh! Yes. Oh! Nice! That's what I'm talking about! Come on, Ellen! Master of all! Oh! Glow, oh. 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 glow, oh. literally. <laughs> That's... Okay. Oh! 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 Again with the drop arrows, why? Take both bows! <laughs> oh! Dual man. wielding. I'm just gonna let this take me. Take the bow! Oh! 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 oh. 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 My shit! <laughs> okay, that's good. Final screen. Oh! 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 Mike, I believe you. Can in do you. It. Yeah, you can do it. Oh, no! No, he's still up. He's still up. No. Yes. Oh, stamp on his head. Stamp on his head. I mean, yes. I mean, oh, no. right. I'm out of here. Victory Road, where are you? No, 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 oh, no, no, no. Oh, 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 oh! oh, oh. Jake's in the ribs. What? Come on, Alan. You can do it. You oh, can that do is, it. That is that is brutal. And... <laughs> oh. Okay. Yeah. Wow, you need to get off this end screen. It's full. Oh, oh, God. Yes, 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 all right, all right, run, run. Stop kicking the air. That never gets loud. Well done making that good sword. Yes! yes! No! Oh, 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 no! No! Okay. Oh, oh! 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 Oh
Oh, look at that lovely yeah. sportsmanship. Oh, <laughs> savage. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How can we win against such evil? <laughs> Stop trying to make yourself the underdogs. You're the champions. You can't be the underdogs. We've had this all, uh, and yet here we are. Somehow, <laughs> on, on here we are. <laughs> okay. Right. Well, amazing scenes there in the mm. violence portion of the showdown of the week. How are we feeling? All violence out? Yeah. Pretty much violence out. Okay. So now we're all going to attempt to soothe you back into a state of calmness with the next round which is the music round, oh. which requires uh, some props. So if everyone could stand oh. up and move over here okay. to this portion of the stage, uh, we're going to start the music round. Ooh. You know, I literally don't have a musical bone in my body. Well, then you're probably going to struggle on this round, right? Because <laughs> it's the music round. Yay. You know, you would if you took two and clocked them together. Oh, OK. Or a trombone. That's a musical bone, isn't it? Yeah. Hey, there it is. <laughs> don't cheer, don't cheer. What's this, Andy? It's the musical mystery box, Hold Luke. It so it is. It's, I've written on the front of it, so that's how you know what that's Drink all about. Drink it is. in, friends. It's really, I mean, it's a wonderfully it. elaborate prop. Give yeah. <laughs> it a shake, Mike. Oh, it's a good song. Beautiful. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's right. Am I musicking? Is this music? Okay, so this round, that doesn't count, Mike. Sorry. I'm sorry. It's no percussion. bonus point, then. I might be, I'll give you a half point for percussion. That's fine. Yes. All right, so the way the music round is going to work is in my musical mystery box. There are six random musical instruments. In this bag, there are six pieces of video game music <laughs> written on cards. <laughs> so what we're going to do is we're going to have members of each team come up. They're going to pick a song from the bag. They're going to pick a musical instrument from the musical instrument mystery box. And then they're going to play it. And their teammate has to guess what the piece of music is that they're trying to play. <laughs> Thanks. So, I'm going to be awful at this. Are we, are we starting with Mike? Are you volunteering? If you like. Okay. Well, let's not get out of the way. Is well. an album? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Impartial, though. Yeah. Okay. I will be marking as we go along. So, Mike. Yes. If you want to uh, delve into the bag. Should we sit in the chairs like critics? Yes. You could if you want. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. All right. Put that away. Sounds good. That's good. Sounds good. I like how we both instinctively this. adopted this. <laughs> <laughs> and then re reach into the musical mystery box. I want you to pick me something out of there. Oh. Oh, there's a lot in there. Is that in? Yeah, that's one. You can bring that out. Mike has selected the stylophone, everybody. Oh. How does okay. this work then? So. Okay. Yeah, you hear that? You can turn it up on the. the there's a volume knob. <laughs> it sounds awful. <laughs> oh, yeah, it does. It sounds this? awful. I don't know, but... John Stylophone. <laughs> John Stylophone. Oh, okay. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. <laughs> the first piece of music, Mike, okay. for Jane to guess. Okay. Please, uh, serenade yes. us with your tones. Okay. Jane, I think that's pretty obvious. Do you, wanna... <laughs> do you know what it, you know what it do you is, Do you need to right? hear that one more time? Uh, no, I think I have it. No, I do. Oh, no, that doesn't sound right. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is going exactly as well as I hoped yeah. it was. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't know. One more time. One uh, more time. Come on. Team. Uh, mm, Any guesses from the audience? <laughs> it's no. really just the very first few notes done very badly wrong. Anyone? No. No, what? no, no one knows. Okay. I, well, I, I haven't seen the car, but I think you're trying to do Still Alive from Portland. <laughs> yeah, I was. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. oh, <laughs> let's hear it again. Let's, let's hear, it hear it again. again. Now we'll know. Oh, I'm making okay. a... No, it's you success. success. Yes, there you go. Huge All right, well, round of applause to Mike anyway. That was a valiant effort. I effect. tried. I tried. I assume this doesn't go back in the box, does yeah, it? Yeah, if you just put that over there. Okay. Oh, okay. no, does that mean the stylophone's out of rotation now? No more stylophone. Well, oh, man. I might, maybe Sorry, I should, Jim. I could put the, should I put the stylophone back in rotation? Do we like the stylophone? Yeah, yeah okay. I'll we put don't the know what else is in the in. box. Stylophone go back in rotation. Okay, Luke, do you want to come up and pick some stuff? Ooh. I, feel, I feel like having box. an album is cheating. 
Just like say. Having an album is cheating. Yeah. Okay. I know. Well, it wasn't a stylophone album. <laughs> do, do you deny that you More have an album? <laughs> no, I can't deny it. Okay. Okay. Well, that feels. Hello. Uh -oh. Oh. oh. We have the xylophone. Luke, does this have a... Yes, uh, it does. We will no. need... <laughs> no, you have to, no it Luke, I need to bash it against your face. <laughs> uh, also, if you would like to pick a... I don't know why you've given me two. <laughs> like, I'm going to be, like, harmonising. <laughs> OK. Well, well, extra points for harmonising. Oh, man. What? That's a hard one. <laughs> OK. OK. Can you hum it to me? Impartial. All right. Okay. That was nice. Like I said, impartial. <laughs> okay. Okay, Ellen, are you ready? <laughs> okay. I want. Maybe I'll start on F. Okay. You got it. Is that the Rainbow <laughs> theme? <laughs> Sounds like a broken doorbell. That doesn't sound... Are you sure you got the right song? Let me try again, let me try again. <laughs> How are we feeling in the audience? Is anyone... It's very tuneful. I feel like there's... That's... Do that again. <laughs> <laughs> to go any further would be confusing. <laughs> <laughs> this is a this is a hard one. No, no, Luke. Luke, what were you playing? I was playing the uh, theme to Street Fighter Two. Oh, oh right, okay. Du, 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 du. You know, it sounds Street like Fighter a theme to Rainbow, that Is 70s that kids TV show. Yeah, I'm not sure that's how the theme to Street Fighter 2 goes, um, which was a significant handicap in playing it. <laughs> Is that not? Would I, was I playing the wrong thing? Yeah, yeah, I think you might have been. So, yeah, I don't know what you're singing. <laughs> Is that Street Fighter 2? Oh, no, that's um, Ryu or Ken's theme. It's one of those. Thank you. Back in the box. Yeah. Back in the box. OK. Uh, Jane, it's your turn. Please, come up. <laughs> Choose a card from worry, the, we'll uh, the cards time. box, right, and I'll then, yeah, a musical instrument from the musical mystery box. How are your musical skills, Jane? Nil. Nil. <laughs> OK, again, this should be a, a real treat. Exactly zero, <laughs> unless you've got a harpsichord in there. Uh, really no. Good. Don't think it's sorry. Oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you do this to me? <laughs> Thought it would be funny. Okay, all right. Oh, Why can I only think of the Simpsons theme right now? <laughs> <laughs> Is it the Simpsons, Simpsons theme? theme. <laughs> no, 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 wait, don't tell me. Uh, no, no, hum it, just give me some. It's, it's amazing how a yeah, tune no, can go out of your head. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. All right, yeah. all right. OK. Oh, wait, I'm looking. Don't yeah, look. Don't look. <laughs> don't look. Just Any chance we can get, Jane. OK, OK, OK. What the heck is that? <laughs> I'm not eating that. I that. guess that's what we're doing. <laughs> oh, OK, what's this? Oh, it's a harmonica. Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah, it's, 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 it's real bad luck to pick the harmonica. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what's the business end? <laughs> <laughs> Well, isn't that one of those instruments that takes years of practice? Oh, yes. <laughs> I don't think it's ever been called the business end. I felt like... <laughs> I was kind of hoping it was a kazoo. <laughs> there is a kazoo in there, I will no! tell you. Don't tell... All right. Well, OK, okay so... <laughs> <laughs> Mike, are you ready? Ready as I'll ever be. <laughs> that sounded good! <laughs> For grizzled old bluesman Jane. <laughs> <laughs> OK, here we go. I mean, it's not bad, considering it's a harmonica. Where are the notes? Like, how do you... <laughs> I would say pay attention to the rhythm more than the note. OK. That's good, though, right? That is good, yeah. yeah. 
Nice. Imagine the notes are all completely wrong. OK. Uh, oh, it's not like the Final Fantasy fanfare or something, is it? No, you're paying attention to the notes, Mike. That's the problem. Oh, sorry. Will you throw it over? When uh, you said it was a music round. You, you don't get a point if I throw it over, but you can guess to see if you knew it. Is it Skyrim? It yes! is Skyrim! <laughs> round of applause. See what you say every single note. Yeah. Just oh no, every single note was wrong. Bag of notes. But the rhythm, <laughs> the rhythm was flawless. Very I jaunty. Think. We would agree. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. It was originally composed on the harmonica, I think. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So it's Ellen's turn. I All right. To Here's a tip: up. don't use this one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Maybe not the harmonica. Well, it's got germs on it's it. It's got Jane germs on else. it. That's how right. we'll defeat them. <laughs> Disease <laughs> in the long run. Yeah. OK, Ellen's looking oh, confident. Oh, she's looking pleased. This oh, is bad no. for us. Ellen's looking, oh, no. Ellen's looking how confident, which means... How does the Kingdoms of Amalur theme go? That, <laughs> yeah. That looks like a kazoo rummage to me as well. Oh, no! She's got... That says kazoo. Oh! oh. She was feeling out for the kazoo. There it is. Which end do you blow in again? I know it's both ways. Don't tell her! I'm not going to tell you which end <laughs> is the kazoo you blow into. I think it's the it's other not... one. I think it's the little end. Oh, so you don't blow into a kazoo. You just, like, make noise into it, like... Mm. Really? <laughs> yeah. That's not like the one I had from the early learning centre when I was in <laughs> The technology's come a long way since then. <laughs> Sorry, time's up. You have no answer. There's no points. That sounds like Super Mario Bros. theme to me. Yes, that is right. Super Mario Bros. theme. Round of applause. Well done, Luke. How on earth did you guess that? Good. So we have two more. Okay. Each team can nominate who they want to come up for their final one. Oh, jeez. So you want to go? Because I did the sword fighting. No. Okay. All right. Great, I believe we have... Team chat. <laughs> yeah, all right, there are two left. <laughs> pick one at random. OK. And then pick an instrument. Jane, your body language and the fact that you're over on this side of the stage... <laughs> all right. ...says, I'm having a good time. <laughs> oh, God. So I don't think here? I know what that is. Well, I know what it is, but I don't, I don't think... You I want know. me to hum it to you, Mike? Yes, please. La, la, OK, la, 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 got it. La, la. Okay. Uh, can I just pick run, uh, any instrument? Yeah, you can pick any instrument. Okay, I'm going to try this phone. All right. Oh, all right. Okay. okay. You ready? Yes. Jane, you ready? Yes. Uh, give me a second to get... Okay. Okay, let me try that again. Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I've lost it. <laughs> you had it! You had it so good! Ten. Yeah, there aren't any minor notes song. on this. Yes, Tetris song. <laughs> yes, Tetris song. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> Round of applause <laughs> for by my album. <laughs> well done, Mike. <laughs> well done playing the Tetris song <laughs> on a xylophone without any minor notes. That was so, <laughs> yeah, so impressive. Okay. Okay. okay, this is the final one. Luke, pick your, choose your weapon. Choose your instrument. <laughs> <laughs> Sing. What have you oh seen, Luke? It's the most instrument of all. It would be such a bad idea to choose this instrument. Do it. Yes, do it. Do it. You've got to do it. Why don't you make it? A... Oh, okay. Fine. It is a... <laughs> the ocarina. <laughs> the kazoo was right there. Okay, Luke. You... <laughs> <laughs> is there a train coming through? <laughs> oh boy. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's. That has you think? <laughs> Just That's like a in single the game. Right, focus on the rhythm of the tune. OK. 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 OK, on. here we go. Hang on a minute, hang on a minute. Hang I on. say I did have a brief practice on the ocarina, and it's unbelievably difficult to play. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is okay, down A up B. OK, here we go. Yes, fine.
nice with Bryce at the end there. <laughs> Anything? It sounds like the mating call of a rare bird. I heard a very... It is the theme song to The Legend of Zelda. As performed on the ocarina by Luke Westway. That is another of the songs on his album. Available on iTunes. Well, congratulations. How was that, Luke, playing the ocarina? That was, well, I feel like I, I, I kind of want to learn it now. <laughs> it's your well, hurt, okay. uh, Expect oh, a massive it's... ocarina solo on the next album. <laughs> it sure hurt my teeth when I bashed it into them. That was good. <laughs> okay, so moving yes. into the next round. We're actually tied because Outside Extra got two points in that round. Yes. Outside Xbox only got one point, but they did have the point from the initial violence round. So we are neck and neck. It's so close. Well, what good music that was. I think <laughs> we can all agree. Why did I write that? I knew it wasn't going to be good. <laughs> <laughs> We're moving into the penultimate round of the showdown, uh, the round that tests the bonds of friendship amongst the channels, because only the truest, closest friends deserve to call themselves showdown champions. Stop hugging! <laughs> So, we are going to test how well our contestants know each other by quizzing them on little-known facts about their channel mates. Uh, I'm going to read out lists of three facts about each person. One will be true, two will be a lie, and I want you to tell me which is the true one. Okay? Wait, wait. Two truths and a lie. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> I see this is a complicated <laughs> So, I'm going to read lists of three facts. Okay. One of the facts will be true, two of them will be lies. Two lies yep. and And I want them to pick out the true fact. Okay. OK? Say the true. Say the true. Say the true. OK. It's fine. I'll walk you through it. It'll be easy. OK. So we're going to start with Luke. Luke, That's if you good. could come up here. And Ellen, you're going to be guessing. So okay. round of applause, please. OK, Ellen, how well do you think you know Luke? How well do you know his secrets that he's what? hidden from you for years? Well, I probably wouldn't know the secrets, because that's why they're called secrets. Keeping secrets from each other. I'm impartial. <laughs> <laughs> so, Ellen, I'm going to read out uh, three facts about Luke. Mm -hmm. And I want you to tell me which is the true one. OK. OK, you ready? OK. Mm. All right. Fact one. A, into his 20s, Luke thought that if you had a negative money score on a quiz show, you owed the quiz show money. <laughs> B, into his 20s, Luke thought that reindeer were mythical. <laughs> or C, into his 20s, Luke thought buffalo wings were made from actual buffalo. <laughs> I want you to talk me through your decision, Ellen. Right, well, I don't think it's the reindeer one. Um, <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> I think it's A or C. And because it's adorably funny, like, it's really funny, the, I want to say the first one. I say the first one, you want to say that into his 20s, Luke thought that if you had a negative money score on a quiz show, you owed the quiz show money. <laughs> I don't know if it is true, but I want it to be true. OK. I'm afraid the answer is C. Luke no! thought buffalo wings were made from actual buffalo. Luke, <laughs> would you care to explain yourself? There are still buffalo, for one thing. And the wings don't have to be literal wings. I know buffaloes don't have wings. I thought the wings was what you called the muscles over... <laughs> <laughs> you thought you were getting fried back muscle of buffalo. Is that... Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Great, OK, interesting insights into Luke there. Uh, okay. How would the quiz show thing work? No one would go on a quiz show. <laughs> <laughs> you could be ruined. <laughs> <laughs> That's the joy. You're a speculator, <laughs> accumulate, Luke. All right, the second fact about Luke, Ellen. I want you to tell me which is the true fact out of these. Okay. A, Luke once won a gold medal in a local singing competition. B, Luke once won a silver medal in a local trampolining competition. Or C, Luke once won a bronze medal in a local dance competition. Well, well this, the singing one, we actually had a conversation once about like, if you could get the talents in the world of like one person, 
like, what would you get? And, you, and Luke said, I'd like to be the best singer in the world. And I was like, oh, you're already a great singer. Do you think that that was instigated I, I by him winning a gold medal once that lit a fire in him? Yeah, well, I think if he had a gold medal, he'd feel more confident in himself, in his own voice. So I don't right. think he'd wish okay. for that. Interesting. Um, I want to see Luke on a trampoline, because that'd be funny. <laughs> but I don't think so. OK. Um, I, I think it's C. You think that Luke once won a bronze medal in a local dance competition? OK. Or, mm, I can tell you, Ellen, that in actual fact, no. <laughs> Luke once won a silver medal in a local trampoline <laughs> competition. <laughs> Do you not remember his Mario jumping from, like, charades? <laughs> Let's see the Mario jump. <laughs> Yay! Oh, oh, and he's oh, lost no. his mic back. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, yeah, Luke, do you care to tell us about this trampolining competition that you've been hiding from us? Uh, what, what was that about? Well, I mean, it went pretty well, but you should have seen the other guy, man. He was... <laughs> 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 I was yeah. lucky to get on that podium, honestly. Wow, OK. Un unusual fact there about Luke. And finally... <laughs> Finally, we have one more fact about Luke. Ellen, I want you to tell me which of these is true. A. Luke was once cast as Dick Whittington in a school performance of the play of the same name. The teachers later changed his role to the smaller part of Cat Sounds. <laughs> B. Luke was once cast as Captain Hook in a school performance of Peter Pan. The teachers later changed his role to the smaller part of The Narrator. Or C, Luke was once cast as Prince Eric in a school performance of The Little Mermaid. The teachers later changed his role to the smaller part of a fish that wasn't in the film. <laughs> <laughs> well, all great roles for a young Westaway. Uh, the thing is, isn't Dick Whittington usually played by a woman? Well, I don't know, Ellen. Like, it's up for you to decide, part. isn't it? Um, I'm impartial. <laughs> don't know, maybe... I think Luke would make a good narrator. I was often cast as narrator. Um, <laughs> uh, but the fish one is quite funny. Because <laughs> technically, you don't know if it's in there. Um, There's only so many fish in the film. <laughs> I know. Um, I think... <laughs> I think. Come on. Maybe I will. Mm, this is so difficult because you. Were, I think he would be great in all those roles. Oh, um, come on. I know. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I said about what was the, the one. the smaller role for Dick Whittington? Uh, cat sounds. Cat sounds. No, you wouldn't have you doing meows. Okay, so it's either narrator or fish. <laughs> I think. I think. I need to press you for an answer, Ellen. The Captain Hook one. You think Luke was once cast as Captain Hook in a school performance of Peter Pan, but they later changed his role to the smaller part of the narrator? Yes. You're correct! Yay! Yay! Right. Why did they drop you from the role of Captain Hook? OK, so I was doing this <laughs> thing when I was Captain Hook, right? Like, I was really going for it. I was really giving it the voice! And uh, basically, the teacher told me, I don't think you should do that voice, <laughs> and I don't think you can do that voice for a sustained amount of time. Uh, but there's this other boy who's doing it the regular way. So, um, <laughs> so you're a narrator now. Aww. I got to have a corncob pipe, so swing some roundabouts. <laughs> cool. Well, round of applause you? there. <laughs> That's good. And you were 26 years old at the time. Is yes, that right? yeah, yes, yeah. of course. 26 yeah, this years was old. last month, yeah. <laughs> All right, so <laughs> a point there for Team Outside Extra. All right, Jane, if you want to come up. Yeah. And Mike, you will be guessing. <gasps> OK. Facts about Jane. Who's excited to hear facts about Jane? <laughs> All right, OK. So, Mike, you want to go here? Just the true ones. OK. Yes. OK, so you want to pick out the true okay. statement. OK. Lay them on the me. following. OK. <laughs> Question one. A. Jane knows the number pi to 15 decimal places. <laughs> B, Jane knows the poem Jabberwocky off by heart. Or C, Jane knows all the words to every song on the album Backstreet's Back by the Backstreet Boys. Hmm, <laughs> well, 
I feel like, I mean, uh, everyone's got a deep love for the Backstreet Boys, but knowing every, I mean, there must be some filler on that album. There must be some real toilet songs on there <laughs> that just wouldn't be How worth it. How dare learning. you <laughs> stand here in front of these people? And just and dismiss Backstreet's Boys. What if Howie heard you? <laughs> um, it's How yeah, Howie, <laughs> Nick, the others. Yeah. <laughs> Love those guys. Kevin I don't, and <laughs> the others. So Justin Timberlake. Right, if you can't remember the others, <laughs> All that's of the a good clue characters. that it's not that. Um, the Jabberwocky poem. I feel like that's something Andy knows off by heart, but I'm not sure it's something that Jane would know off by heart necessarily. Interesting. But Pi. Being a physicist at university and stuff, uh, I feel like pi, knowing pi to that level would be useful for a lot of the calculations and not having to look it up every single time. So I think it's the pi one. You think it's pi to 15 decimal places? Yes. I can tell you you're correct. Jane does know yes. pi to 15 decimal places. Okay. Yes. Jane, would you care to? No. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I need to know that you can do it, otherwise I don't know if it's true, <gasps> so... 3.14159265. Calculators out, folks. 3.14159265378.9. Round of applause, there we go. Also, it's not true that you would need to know that as a physicist or an engineer, because Electra once told me that only an insufferable pedant would know it to more than two decimal places. <laughs> right. That's but so, you, those wild physics parties where you're just having a few drinks and reciting yeah. pi. Well, Crazy there you go. times. Have a pie off. <laughs> yeah, exactly. More decimal places. Okay, so question number two. Okay. About Jane. Mike, I want you to answer this. Jane's grandmother's name is Ellen. B. Jane's middle name is Ellen. Or C. Jane once had a cat named Ellen. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Well, I know James, Jane's middle name is not Ellen, so I can rule that one out. Uh, cat named Ellen. We all know you've got to name cats after items of food, right? Those are the rules. Yep, those are the rules. Ellen, as far as I know, is not an item of food, nor a part of a buffalo. Uh, so I think we can rule that one out. <laughs> Outrageous. Rising above it. You'll have the moral victory, but we're going to have, have the actual rubbing. one, yeah. okay? Yeah. Um, so I'm going to go with grandmother. You're going with Jane's grandmother's name is Ellen. I'm afraid to tell you, Mike, you are incorrect. What? Jane's middle name is Ellen. Yeah! How do you not know that? Oh. Is it? Break my heart. <laughs> Actually, it's sort of a trick because I have two middle names, and one of them is Ellen. One of them right. is Ellen. The other one yeah. is absolutely not Ellen, though. It's a family Would you name. confirm yeah. that? Yeah, no. There right. you go. I'm afraid. No point there. Sorry. Sorry, Mike. Mm. All right. So, I'm so confident. Uh, the final question about Jane. Yes. Mike, I want you to answer this. A. Jane was in an amateur production of Matilda. B. Jane was in an amateur production of Grease. Or C. Jane was in an amateur production of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory seems like it would be big budget for an amateur production. Okay. I mean, you've got to get a dude up in a pipe, no, someone's got to inflate to the size of a room. You need a purple tuxedo on you, top hat. Yeah, it, it, well, yeah, quite. Yeah. That's the most difficult I bit. I mean, I need that. As well. And the shrinking the guy to the size of a I don't think you TV have to picture. literally do that. I'm pretty that's... sure <laughs> them's okay. the rules, aren't right. they? Fine. Uh, that one seems a bit too high budget. Uh, what were the other ones? Matilda and Greece were the other ones. Matilda, hmm, 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 hmm. Hmm. I always thought it would be bad to do a live production of Matilda for the person who has to eat all that cake every single night. Seems <laughs> good. Think of the calories. Talking about. <laughs> <laughs> Seems great. <laughs> um, so I will go for what the other one was, whatever that was. Greece. Greece. Ah, one of the pink ladies, probably. Greece. Right? You want me no. to confirm? In incorrect. Oh, come on. Jane, Jane, what were you in an amateur production of? It was Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. How did you oh. do the tiny boy? It was not high production value. <laughs> oh, that's a shame. Still round of applause there. <laughs> okay. Mike's guesses. I mean, the scores are even still. That is one yeah. point, so we are still one tied. Point. Ellen, Whoop. I want you to come up here and answer some questions. <laughs> Luke, you're going to be guessing Ooh. these Let's little known facts about Ellen. about Ellen Rose. OK. OK, you feel confident? You feel you know Ellen pretty well? Yeah. You feel, oh, man, some Psychic of this stuff. Psychic link established. All right, good. It's going to be fine. OK. It's going to be absolutely fine. Good, so I'm impartial. So. First question, Luke, yeah. I want you to tell me what is the true statement among okay. these. So A, at school, Ellen was once given detention for being incredibly late to class because she got distracted by a cat on her walk to school. <laughs> true. 
I know I'm not playing. B, at school, I Ellen... mean, I will hear the other ones <laughs> just in case. <laughs> B, at school, Ellen once avoided detention for shouting in class by framing another student. <gasps> or C, at school, Ellen never had detention. In fact, one teacher would send her on errands so they could shout at the class without her there. <laughs> OK, shall I explain my reasoning? Please do. <laughs> Ellen has told me about literally every cat she's ever met. <laughs> <laughs> and shown me photos. And she didn't mention a cat in connection with detention. And I haven't seen a photo, so... Even though it definitely was the one that sounded the most likely, I am going to rule that one out. Okay. And I hope my logic is sound. OK. Uh, hmm, so now the question is... Is Ellen evil? <laughs> <laughs> I ask you to examine the facts, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Meryl wins meat grinder for instance. <laughs> hey! Meryl wins meat grinder. We all regret it. Uh, okay. <laughs> it was the grease. <laughs> oh, blame the grease! Don't yes. blame the sharp spikes. No. Anyway, say this again, is for Ellen, tomorrow. This tell is it to tomorrow. the judge. Okay. Um, I think I'm going to go for uh, the one where Ellen never had detention and someone uh, and the rest of the class got shouted at while Ellen was out of class. I can tell you, Luke, you are correct. Okay. The, the, teacher was, uh, the teacher was like, I don't want you to have to see this, Ellen. Please leave. <laughs> Such what? a little Hermione. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Let me see it. There it is. <laughs> there it is. Ellen, uh, care to elaborate on this? Yeah, yeah, I was... Not an in, I was an unintentional teacher's pet. Uh, in terms of my teacher would be like, um, Ellen, could you take the stand of staff in front of me? And then I'd shut the door behind me and then, what are you all doing? <laughs> now the rest of you! Uh, yeah, and if anyone ever got sent on an errand with me, they were like, yes. So. <laughs> all right, well, there you go. Shocking facts about Ellen there. <laughs> <laughs> she was good. <laughs> <laughs> all right, question number two, Luke. Yeah, okay. Which is the true one? All right. A. Ellen once had a bike thrown at her. <laughs> Sorry, B, I couldn't laugh. <laughs> B. Ellen once had a boomerang thrown at her. Or C. Ellen once had a small dog thrown at her. <laughs> Ellen once had a what? A small dog. A small dog. Right, OK. Yeah, it, doesn't, it doesn't say what breed. A small dog thrown at her. But it doesn't say what breed. Ellen would specify the breed. Yes, but I, <laughs> I collated the questions, so don't okay, read anything right, into okay, that. OK, OK, OK. Uh, all right, so if Ellen had a bike thrown at her, she could have died. <laughs> Bikes are big. <laughs> Ellen's small. <laughs> um, so I don't know, I'm not leaning towards that. Also, I reckon you'd, you'd have a scar, like a good scar. Shaped like a off. bike. Yeah, in the shape of a bike. <laughs> <laughs> Full back scar in the shape of a bike. <laughs> so you've got uh, boomerang or small dog? Um, it, you know, boomerang... OK, I'm going to go with boomerang, because boomerang is the kind of thing that someone would throw at you when you were younger, being like, don't worry, it will come back. <laughs> <laughs> and then whammo. So I'm going to go with boomerang. OK, Luke, I can tell you that, in fact, Ellen once did have a bike thrown at her. <laughs> Are you okay? Ellen, please explain. <laughs> please explain how this came to occur. Um, when I was at nursery, there was one kid who really nursery? didn't like me, and we had really these like big heavy bikes in the playground. Like they were like these big orange metal ones, and he won. I was like standing there, and then just got flattened by a bike. And wow. Then my friend came to help me, and then when the teachers came, the other boy had run off, and they thought it was him, and I had to, through tears, being like, shut up, shut up, my friend. So, yeah. But the right. teachers didn't listen. They were like, Ellen, get away from this. <laughs> I'll have them expelled, don't you worry. All right. Well, Ellen didn't go into details in her email about it. I thought that would be more of a fun story. <laughs> <laughs> a child had a bike thrown at them. All right. Okay. All right, cool. <laughs> okay, the third one. Yeah. And the final one for Ellen Luke. Okay, so I need this to get in the lead, is that right? Yes. Okay. Well, no, you got one, so you are in the lead, although they haven't gone yet. So. A. All right, so, A, Ellen has performed on stage in the West End. B, Ellen has performed on stage at the Edinburgh Fringe Festival. Or C, Ellen has performed on stage at the Comedy Store. So, West End, Edinburgh Fringe, or Comedy Store? All plausible, all plausible. Um, okay, right, so, Ellen, um, 
I really like the Comedy Store, the one in, in London. I've been there quite a few times, and I feel like I probably must have mentioned that to Ellen, and there's no way she wouldn't have been like, I performed there. <laughs> so, I'm going to rule that out. Uh, or am I? Yeah, I'm going to rule that out. Um, okay. <sighs> I think... I think Ellen performed at the Royal Albert Hall in some capacity. I had that in my head for some reason. Not that's, neither here, that's neither here nor there. Get out of my head, Mike. Um, <laughs> all right, OK, I'm going to go for uh, the Edinburgh Fringe, because I know that Ellen went to uni in Scotland, and that's close enough for a guess. OK. All right, Columbo. But she grew up in London, so the Western... What do you guys think? <laughs> no, you know what? Follow your heart. I'll go for the fringe, I'll go for the fringe, I'll go for the fringe. Just, just don't follow your heart ever again. You're wrong! It was oh, actually no. the West End. Oh. Ellen, please explain. Um, I was a big fan of the Regis Shakespeare Company, and I went to go see it lots, and one time I went, they dragged me up on stage because there's an audience participation bit, and I had to stand on the stage of the Criterion Theatre in Piccadilly Circus and make animal noises. Can we hear some now? Um, there was one I had to do, the noise of a trout. <laughs> <laughs> Who could dispute that? Yeah. But I did have, uh, I made a suggestion at a show uh, at the Edinburgh Fringe, uh, the, this uh, improv musical group, and I, I put a pun out there, and they liked it so much that they named a character after me. So you were close. I was close, but you didn't close. get actually get no. Unfortunately, there's, there's only one point for that round, so round of right. applause there. If you want to make your way back to the chairs. We're on to the final one. We're going to learn a bit more about Mr. Mycicle Channel. <laughs> you would like to... Don't tell them my full name. <laughs> oh, no, that was question one. Jane, you're going to be guessing okay. these facts about Mike. Yeah. You ready? You think yeah. you know Mike pretty well? I know literally everything literally about everything Mike. Literally everything there is things to know. Things he doesn't I'm know, an open I know. Book. Oh, God. About Mike. <laughs> things you can only observe yeah. through a powerful long lens telescope. <laughs> <laughs> OK, good. So, question one about Mike. Jane, I want okay. you to tell me which is the true facts. OK. OK. okay. A. Mike failed his driving test because he got lost. Uh, B, Mike failed his driving test because he got in the wrong car. Uh, or C, Mike failed his driving test for speeding. Ah. Uh, well, I'm flabbergasted because it means Mike failed his driving test. You see Mike drive, right? <laughs> <laughs> Can yeah, I just I've check been in you that car since, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I have, yes. I very <laughs> safely drove Ellen up to Birmingham. It was yeah. fine. Yeah. yeah. Zero fatalities. Right. Okay. That right. time. I don't think you can get lost on a driving test because they tell you where to go. They're not like, let's go to Bristol and then you just drive. <laughs> so uh, I don't think you can get in the wrong car. And also, I don't think they'd fail you if you got in another car. They'd just be like, that's the car over there. Depends what you did in there when you got in. Well, that seems to fall outside the the true fact that you've just read out. So <laughs> yeah. I'm going to go with speeding because that's badass. <laughs> and, uh, and I can see it happening. OK. Yeah. Uh, I can tell you that you're correct. Mike failed his driving yeah. test for speeding. How Mike. fast? Well, well, uh, it was the first, it was, I failed my first, first driving test uh, for speeding because, in my defence, uh, this, <laughs> the speed limit sign was kind of faded on my side of the road, and I didn't <laughs> see the one on the other side of the road. So I think I probably went about 45 in a 30. <laughs> so oh. Don't speed kids, it's bad. Um, but yeah, oh. speeding yeah, is actually bad. legit fail for speeding. Is that a major? That's, it, a major. that's a major. That's that a is major. a major fault. Insta fail. Wow. <sighs> OK, well, well, there we go. One point there. Uh, second question. OK. A, Mike was once the opening act for DJ Shadow. B, Mike was once the opening act for the Kings of Leon. <laughs> or C, Mike was once the opening act for a burlesque club. <laughs> oh, OK. The order in which I wish that were true <laughs> <laughs> is the burlesque club, <laughs> then the Kings of Leon, <laughs> and then DJ Shadow. But I reckon it's DJ Shadow, because I know that Mike did some DJing. Right. And you can't... I mean, I guess you could DJ as a warm-up act for Kings of Leon. <laughs> or, or a burlesque Or a burlesque act, for that matter. Yeah, but, it depends uh, what you're I wearing. I reckon it's DJ Shadow. He seems like the right tier of famous. Okay. I have Mike Channel. <laughs> <laughs> He's pretty famous, that guy. Uh, I can tell you you're correct. Yes, yeah. Mike was yeah. once the opening act for DJ Shadow. Yeah. 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 Mike, yeah. how did that happen? 
Uh, so they released a game called DJ Hero a while back, and I was working on a magazine called Official Xbox Magazine, and we decided it'd be funny if I learned how to DJ in like a month, and then, and then I was at the DJ Hero launch party. It does sound I, pretty funny. Now that it was it, terrifying, yeah. actually, yes. Okay. And the bit about the no musical bone Were you like body. an iTunes DJ? Like, did you have a MacBook? And you're like, oh, yeah, yeah it was on my laptop and stuff, but I had the uh -huh. vinyl and everything as well. Oh, okay, so, fair, like, fair, Serato fair. and things. It was good, and I've completely nice. forgotten how to do it now. So. Okay. Oh, man. Cool. Nothing and the final though. question about Mike. Yes. Jane, I want you to tell me which of these is the correct true fact about okay. Mike Channel. I'm listening. A. Mike shares his full name with a comedy character played by former Have I Got News For You host Angus Deaton. B. Mike shares... <laughs> Angus Massive Deaton. Angus Deaton Thank fan in the it. house. Angus Deaton is in the house, everybody. Yeah. Thank you. I don't uh, think he's got much else on at the moment, so... B, Mike shares his name with the inventor of various improvements to dynamite. Or C, Mike shares his name with an American League baseball player. An American... Major League baseball Major player. Major League baseball player. I'm going to guess... The man who invented TNT? No, he... Is he like Mr. TNT? Various improvements <laughs> to dynamite, not the original uh, invention. Well, I mean, that would be amazing, like, nominative determinism, mm. where it's, like, explosiveness just... Runs in his blood. Yeah. My channel. But I'm, I'm going to go baseball player, because that's... You're going to go American Major League Baseball player? Yeah, because I know so little about baseball, <laughs> but okay. that seems likely. I can tell you that you are incorrect, ah! I'm afraid. Mike shares uh, oh. his name with a comedy character played no, by Angus Deaton. Oh. Yeah. Oh, well, I love you, apparently. Yeah. She had okay. a fun fact when I first joined. My mum was like, oh, my channel. He's got the same name as that Angus Deaton character. So. There you go. <laughs> you would have got that. It's from a, a radio comedy called Radioactive. And the idea was they were, they were all named after sort of radio -y sounding things. And because I have a ridiculous Mike name, channel. Mike Channel was actually a character. Oh, yeah. man. It's very OK, good. well, I can tell you that the score is going into the final round. Outside Xbox is ahead by one point. <gasps> Ooh. Yes. Yeah, so it is currently uh, five to Outside Xbox and four to Outside Extra. Nice. So round of applause for the friendship round, everybody. Good guessing. Uh, if we could get the table up on stage now, please. I'm looking at the trophy. This is the round that's going to decide everything, because it's actually worth two points. So right. whoever wins this round oh, no. will win the showdown. It's the golden snitch round. Yeah. <laughs> it's the golden snitch Don't round, everybody. <laughs> The final round in this year's showdown of the week is I want both teams to draw a Pikachu. <laughs> oh, no! Oh, so right. partial. I love it. Oh, no. <laughs> That's oh, right. No. Is he the one with the thing in the back and the... I don't know. The fire tail? The Pokemon. So each team is going to have two minutes. They're allowed to work on the drawing together, or they can work individually. Oh. Uh, at the end, I'm going to mix the drawings up. I'm going to label them. I'm going to put them up. And you, the audience, are going to decide which is the better Pikachu. Because every time I judge Pikachu, everyone's like, oh, you're being so harsh to Ellen, even though it's a legitimately blind judging process. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, yes. Was that? Sorry. A bit loud. <laughs> anyway. Um, yeah, so if you guys want to come over here. Is that a giant post-it note? Here we have Marcus, okay. we have... All right, I'll draw the right half. Okay. You draw the right half. Marcus, you. <laughs> like the two faces of the Pokemon yeah, yeah, world. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh. Or we do and that we have thing thin Marcus as well. We draw like the head and then the body. Oh, the yeah, no doubt, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We got time. How long we got? Uh, you're going to have two minutes. Oh, we don't oh, have great. time. <laughs> OK. OK. I'm going to let you know when your right, time starts. OK. You got the yellow pens, right? Okay. okay. Well, no <laughs> <laughs> There's no colouring. There'll right. be no colour. You have two minutes. Okay, okay. everybody. Are you ready? So, yeah. Do the all right, let's go. And, and I want to hear you guys cheering you for the, your Pikachu guys okay. who started. Yeah. Right. What does the colouring look like? Okay, okay. I'm I'm gonna gonna go. Is it like even a he? Do we know? Right, I'd be moving around to see what we've got going on. Oh, he's got a little... Okay. Eyes? Yeah, like... Is that ears? That's like the eye with the sort of... Oh, okay, okay. And then cheeks? And then... And then... Oh, we've got an outside extra chart going. And then I think he's like... He's got ears, right? Like... Oh. Oh, interesting. And then ears. Interesting. You do one ear, I'll do the other ear. Ears. Time check, please, Judge. Ears. Oh, okay. That's going on. Uh, 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 okay. You've had oh, 38 like like. seconds. It's like a there is a minute sack. and 20 seconds left. Oh, no. Oh, what? He <laughs> looks like a <laughs> What's going on here, guys? Talk me through your design here. <laughs> okay, so uh, right, okay. we are... Um, let's do a we are, foot, uh, right? I'll 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 away, is what's happening over okay. here. Um, we are... Oh, this was a bad move. Oh, it's a bit move. cramped. Yep, okay. Oh, it's no. a bit cramped. He's all right. Oh, oh boy. I wish you could see what's going oh, on there. Oh, I'm committed to this now. <laughs> oh, no. Um, Lightning. Okay. Cute arms. Okay. He's got adorable little arms. 
Oh, he's got arms. He's got arms. Okay. Oh my goodness. Does he have you a tummy know, thing? You know uh, Pikachu. Does he have, does he have a tummy, tummy thing? Arms. Anyone? What do you mean, like a Care Bear? Like no a lightning bolt? Yeah. 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 Like, oh, no. I think so. So we're I, done. Like way I, ahead of time. I think we're done. Yeah. Yeah. Is there is there seconds, seconds left for detail? Yeah, maybe. Thank you, Ellen. Yes, that's what the nose looks like. Okay. How how long left? You have 30 seconds left. Does he have a ton? That's. Oh, that is. No, that's. I thought that was a happy smile. Yeah, it is. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe like a tongue and a. Yeah, if he was. Oh yeah, very nice, nice detail. Uh, what if else? This is the thing that loses Does it. Does he have like a belly thing? All right. Does yeah. right. you have a belly? Beautiful. Okay. <laughs> These are both looking excellent. If I just seen that, the end of the You're in the final ten seconds. Thing. My Pikachu. Uh, nine. How dare you? Eight. Oh, I'll tell you what. Let's make it. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Pens down. Step away from the Pikachus. Step away from these Pikachus. I'm going to go mix these up. What are we <laughs> doing? Secrets. Whoa. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, yeah, you've got to shuffle them. <laughs> All right. Oh, we did sign us. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I will tear Wait, off, let me sign will tear the off portions of each one so you will not know. No, 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 oh, we no, can no, just we'll sign, sign, we'll sign outside them. extras as well. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> we're going to fake sign theirs. So you don't know who did what. Yeah. But then it's not going to be worth it. Also, anything. we do need to take this off the thing, don't we? <laughs> Hang on, hang on. Okay. All right. I'm going to put these up on the back wall. Can you? They're, yes, oh, they're okay. giant post-it notes. Let's ruin the set for the other two days of EGX. <laughs> okay, can everyone see these Pikachus? <laughs> these marbles of modern art. <laughs> wow, they. <laughs> what Tell us what, what you can you think. say? What can you even say? <laughs> oh boy. Okay, so we're going to do a clap test to see which is the best Pikachu. So I'm going to point to the Pikachu, I'm going to ask you to clap. I want you to clap for the Pikachu that you think is the best Pikachu. So we're going to start with Pikachu number one. Clap if you think this is the best Pikachu. <laughs> right. Strong showing for Pikachu one. Now clap if you think Pikachu two is the best Pikachu. <laughs> I think that was Pikachu 2. Yeah. I think I that think that was like Pikachu 2 to yeah. me. Sounded like Pikachu 2. Teams, do you want to go and stand next to your Pikachus? Oh, it's like Bake Off. I love it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> there is. is it two Pac-Men. <laughs> Don't be cruel. Sorry. Don't be cruel. <laughs> I'll have you know that A, the bigger the eyes, the more adorable. <laughs> I'll have you know that B, it's an Alolan one. Huh? So oh, it's okay. Nice touch. Okay. Look at his tail! <laughs> <laughs> Why is was it, was it the eyes? coquettish foot <laughs> that sold it? Oh, it's a bit like uh, quote marks. Like, mm. Oh, yeah. The mouth, that's a very good mouth. Uh, so you can see, it's not just me, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> OK, well, with that extra two points, that puts outside Xbox over the top. We do have a champion of the showdown of the week, 2018, our new champions, outside Xbox, everyone. Yay! Please. Well done, well done. Bring it in. Thank you, Art School, you. with you. <laughs> so. Here is your trophy. Well done. Yes. yes. Here it is. Yes. Yes. Take, a, take a thing each. Yes. Would you care to say a few words? Yes. Okay, well, I couldn't have done it without my teammates. What a wonderful performance, knowing that I'm a terrible, terrible driver. <laughs> drive far too fast. This is true. I'd like to thank... Who would you like to thank, Jen? Lord You're... Cthulhu. Lord Cthulhu. <laughs> <laughs> of course. I'm sure quietly manipulating the evil. result. Cthulhu is delighted. Yay! Uh, outside ex extra, any words? Uh, I, it, it's easy to look back and, and see mistakes that were made along the way, but I think uh, <laughs> it's literally easy to look back <laughs> and see mistakes that were made along the way. But I think, I think at the end of the day, you just got to say you, you guys absolutely smashed it. Enjoy yeah. your year of basking. You yes, guys. we it's will. Be... And you'll be back, won't you? Yes. With yeah, the... we'll be back. We're the underdogs again. Yes. yes. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, I do all, all right. of those. Well, all that remains. <laughs> All that remains, guys, is to say thank you so much for coming to this 
ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> so we're so pleased that you all came out to see us uh, do this. Um, uh, we couldn't do stuff like this without you guys. Uh, in, in a way, you are the true winners of the showdown, but there is only one trophy, so we're yeah. going to keep it the rest of the year. Uh, but thank you so much, everybody. Uh, enjoy the rest of your EGX. Uh, we've had a really great time having you here. Uh, we'll see you next time. Goodbye. Thank you. Thank you. Goodbye. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait, take a picture. Oh, yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait. We got this. We got this. Yeah. yeah.